Hello y'all, welcome back. Today we are gonna talk about my top 11 Amazon kitchen favorites. These are kind of gadgety things, a couple cleaning things, just things that have really made my life easier. As a busy mom, I have eight kids, I work from home, I homeschool. So we are here in our home, in our kitchen. We eat basically three meals a day here. So there's some things that have just come in clutch, okay? They've just been like a little lifesaver floating in to help my tired old mama self. If they're helpful to me, they they might be helpful to you too, which is why I want to share them with you today. We're going to go through, I'm going to share each item with you. Every item is under, well, really wanted to do everything under 20, but there's like a couple things that are just a hair over 20. So I feel like I have to be fair here and say these items are all under $25. Everything will be linked down below for you. So check the description box if you want to check something out. Let's go. Item number one is this cord organizer, basically. And what this is, is it's just kind of like a silicone item that has a sticky back and you apply that to your appliance, whether it be a mixer, uh, you know, an air fryer, a coffee pot, anything that you don't, well, you can even leave it plugged in all the time or not, doesn't matter. The point is, is it makes it so that, you know, a lot of items will come with a way to wrap your cord up, but a lot of kitchen appliances don't. And so this basically gives you that same effect of the cord organizer that you would have on a vacuum cleaner, but you can put it on any appliance that you want. Uh, they come in lots of different colors, multi-packs. You can match your appliances or not. It doesn't matter, obviously, uh, but it's really nice and a really easy way to keep your cords tidy so your counters don't look cluttered. You don't have a bunch of these little black snake cord looking things running all over your kitchen counters. Item number two are these pot lid holders. So we kind of have awkward uh, space in our kitchen. We have a large kitchen and a lot of cabinets, but a lot of them are like half cabinets, false cabinets. It just kind of makes things a little bit challenging. We don't have good spots for pots and uh, pot lid organizer type things. So I really love these. It's very similar to the cord organizer in that it's got the adhesive back. You just apply it to the inside of a cabinet and then you can slide your pot lid right on in there and it holds it so that when you close the cabinet, the pot lids are kind of you know, lined up on the inside of the cabinet and not taking up space inside the cabinet or drawer or wherever you want to use these pot lid organizers. And honestly, it's one of those items that I feel like there's probably a number of other crafty genius uses for. I just have to figure those out. Haven't had time to think on it, but I bet there's a lot of other uses for those as well. Number three are these adhesive sponge holders. They are stainless steel, very similar uh, to some of the previous items I've talked about in that it has that adhesive back to it. You just wanna clean your sink really well, make sure that it is really dry before you adhere these to it. If you've got a stainless steel sink, it just kind of blends into the sink and gives you a nice spot to set your sponge so that you're not just leaving it in the bottom of the sink or, you know, sometimes we have those little drawers in the front that open up, but I also feel like the sponge has to be like a very certain level of dry to be able to go in there. So it's nice to be able to put a sponge or a wash rag or something, just kind of hang that on the inside side of the sink. That's just one of those items that uh, is, is way handier than you realize. It's the little things. I talk about that all the time, just like little simple things that make life a little bit easier, smoother. Uh, and this is just one of those things. I really, I really Number four are the bamboo drawer dividers. Now I talked about drawer dividers in my clothing video and I actually put these bamboo drawer dividers into the kitchen drawers last year when I did my first sort of declutter and organization and I've loved them. So these things have been around for over a year now in our home and I absolutely love them because if you have larger uh, drawers that are, it's kind of like in the abyss, right? It's like a black hole and everything gets lost inside of it. It's really nice to be able to use these to sort of create that organization uh, to be custom, right? It's a bespoke organization for your drawers that allows you to divide them however you want, evenly, not evenly, uh, to be able to put your spatulas, knives, whatever. I'm using them in multiple drawers in my kitchen and they are very handy. They come in a number of sizes. They are definitely worth it. Number five is my meat smasher. <laughs> this is one of those items, I think I talked about this last year a little bit in the Prime Day deals uh, or some video like that. This is a, a kind of an odd looking little tool, but it's for smashing and grinding up like ground beef, ground turkey when you're cooking up that kind of meat. And you know, you always think, well, I just have a spatula, that's fine. I really like my ground meat 
when it's cooked to be ground very finely, if that makes sense. Like I don't want big chunks of ground meat because then that chunk doesn't get all the flavor of the seasonings and stuff. And this just makes that so easy. Again, it's kind of one of those utensils that you feel like, do I really need that? Well, of course you don't need any of these things, but it definitely makes cooking up ground meat way easier. And I was very pleasantly surprised by how much I like it and, and how much I use it. Number six are these magnetic cups for kids. I've talked about these multiple times. A number of you guys have messaged me and commented and told me that you got these and they've been lifesavers for you as well. If you have kids that are constantly coming in and out of the kitchen for drinks, uh, we end up with like kind of cups all over the counter and it gets like, cluttered. And so these are really nice. They're stainless steel. So you're not going to get like mold and stuff like that going in those. Uh, they're stainless steel. They have these silicone bands that wrap around them with a little magnetic piece on the back. So the kids can come in and they're different colors, the silicone uh, holders. So the kids can come in, you know, get some water out of the Berkey. I can't, can't really see it behind me. It's back there. Out of the Berkey or fridge or Brita or filtered water or what a sink water, whatever, however you do water. Uh, they can come in and get a sip of that and then they can put their cup back up on the fridge. Keeps it tidy. They're small cups. It's enough to, you know, get a few good gulps of water uh, and then put that back up on the side of the fridge. Just keeps things tidy and organized. I've said this many times before. I find that tidiness and organization begets further tidiness and organization. It's easier for my family to kind of keep things in the order in which I have them when I have things not super cluttered, very decluttered and tidy. It's uh, just easier because they can see, wow, that does look wildly out of place when I just set that cup on the counter and everything else is tidy around it. Number seven, speaking of magnetism, are these magnetic measuring spoons, this little set. They stack together. These actually come in multiple finishes. I didn't, I don't know if I didn't see the brass gold because that's usually like my go-to, um, but I didn't. I got the like the silver stainless steel ones, which is totally fine. They all work great, but I love that they kind of nest and stack on each other, but they're also magnetized so that they stay that way in your drawer. It comes with a little flat stick that's a leveler for when you're measuring things like flour or whatever, and you want to level it off uh, but it's very very nice very handy again that they kind of stick together stay together in the drawer they're not just you know splayed out everywhere and they're pretty you know handy helpful that's the kind of things I like I think we're on number eight, and that is this cord concealer plate, basically, is how I would describe this item. So if you, again, don't like the look of cords kind of cluttering up the walls, your counters, your backsplashes in your kitchen, basically this is a face plate that plugs in, and then the cord, the white cord goes down, and they give you all of these little pieces to help you um, adhere the cord so that you're kind of like, it's not becoming like a wily all over the place thing, right? You can go like straight down with it, over. They give you a few different shapes of those. And then you kind of hide that where you have your little uh, extra outlet that basically, I think they have three plugs in them. Um, so the, the back of your, you know, backsplash or wall is just, you've kind of got like this solid white plate covering it. You can hide that uh, like sort of extension cord uh, with the multiple power outlets behind something. And that's where you can kind of plug everything in. So it's not so you just don't see it. You don't see everything all plugged in all the time. Uh, we have certain things that we have to leave plugged in all the time. Obviously it's a good idea to unplug appliances and stuff like that, but we have like some tracking collars and stuff for our dogs that have to stay plugged in for the Bluetooth part to work right. So that's why we kind of have it over in our like pet area right now. And it's really, really handy. So instead of those obnoxious black cords hanging out, I can kind of tuck them away and hide them behind my little cabinet here. It just keeps things again, looking a little tidier visually which for me with ADD uh, like it the tidier things can look ha huh, the more like calm I feel and also the better ability I have to pay attention <laughs> number nine are these silicone baking mats I talked about these uh, in the fall sometime or summer of last year I love them they're a super good deal I want to say you get two for like $7.99 don't quote me on that I'll put everything down below in the description box but these are awesome again they save you from having to wash your big cookie sheets all the time. Also, the silicone baking mats help things to cook more evenly. If you've got some older baking mats, they're getting like a little bit discolored and stuff and you're finding that the, they're not quite baking as evenly as they once did, uh, these silicone baking mats really help uh, cookies and other items like that to bake more evenly and it makes cleanup really easy. Number 10 is the Tupperware food storage lid holder. Again, this is an item that 
I'm not sure I ever would have thought was like a necessity in a kitchen, but I think we can all agree that Tupperware, glass, plastic, doesn't matter, the lids are just a pain in the booty, okay? Whatever drawer, cabinet, it often ends up just turning into a big jumbled mess of storage containers and lids. It's hard to find things, and you're constantly trying lids on, like pants on your, your storage containers, like, do these fit? Do these fit? No, ah! This is really handy because it allows you to organize them in a uh, sort of upright, vertical fashion, and you can kind of see, you can organize by size, just makes it so handy. Again, this is something that we put in last year when I did that organization and it just, oh, I have to tell you, it's one of the things that like has not changed one single bit in this kitchen since we did it last year. And that's how I know it's really good because I don't feel the need to change it, move anything around. I've got a few of those items in here that have just, they've stood the test of a year in my home, which is, it's a big ask, okay? It's a big ask and they made it. So they're pretty good. And the last thing, number 11, coming in hot, is our Angry Mama Microwave Cleaner. This thing is the best, okay? I saw this and I thought, well, that's just funny, okay? Because first of all, how many of us moms have come into the kitchen with our arm, like hands on our hips, like, ah, oh, so upset about the mess or disaster. You can get different colors of the little Angry Mama. Mine is green and purple. Just pop her head off <laughs> and fill it up with vinegar and water pop her head back on, put it into the microwave on high power for like five to eight minutes. It takes about two minutes or so for it to start to steam. And then that steam, you know, goes for the next few minutes. It releases with that vinegar and steam. You open your microwave door and all of those like food chunks and nastiness are all like loosened up and sort of sliding down and off. So all you gotta do is grab a sponge, a rag, a paper towel, whatever, and uh, wipe it out and your microwave is clean with the power of water and vinegar and not really any elbow grease from you. That's the kind of product I can definitely get behind. And these things go out of stock all the time on Amazon because I feel like people love them so much. She's definitely a welcome addition to my kitchen and my cleaning routine and schedule. I love her so much. My angry mama makes me a happy mama, and I love her for that. All right, you guys, that is it for my top 11 uh, items from Amazon for my kitchen that I just love. These items are all under about $25, under $20, under $25. You know, prices can fluctuate a bit on Amazon, but all of them will be linked down below for you. They are just perfection, love them so much, definitely worth their cost, and things that have just made my life easier, which is the kind of stuff that I love to share with y'all. So that is it for me today, you guys. I hope you have enjoyed, and I will see you again very soon.